It's been two weeks since a Decatur man was killed in an officer-involved shooting, and Stephen Perkins was shot by a Decatur officer in his front yard on September 29th. And since then, hundreds of community members have been calling on law enforcement to charge the officers involved in an incident they say was unjustified. News 19's Daryl Burke has more on the latest protests that took place in the River City today. Many across the Decatur community and beyond say these ongoing protests are key in getting the answers they are seeking. Some say they refuse to let up until justice is served. The only way that justice is going to come is with pressure. Hundreds from the River City Saturday continued their calls for answers and transparency following the officer involved shooting that killed Stephen Perkins. Protesters began their journey on Lee Street in Decatur and continued throughout the downtown parts of the city, chanting things like justice for Steve and arrest the cops. Some say they're hoping these efforts are a driver for change and something like this is prevented from ever happening again. Today matters for Steve's family, for his daughters, for his wife, and it matters for the future. We shouldn't be fighting the same battles that our grandparents are fighting, but we are here and I hope this is the last time that we're here. And that's why we're here. Hundreds could be seen lining the street on 6th Avenue in the River City with cars passing by honking in support. Perkins's cousin Cherie Head says staying persistent in their calls are significant and it's the only way they believe their family will ever receive justice for their loved one. It's absolutely important that we remain consistent. We're not we're not going to forget um, as Steve's never coming back to us. And so because of that, we're going to honor him and we're going to keep fighting. We're going to fight with prayer. We're going to fight with protests. We're going to fight with vigils. We're going to fight at city council meetings, wherever there's a space for us to say his name and get the message out there. We're going to do it. Indicator. Daryl Burke, News 19.